killed while walking her dogs in a normally quiet, low crime area. Tonight, Baltimore City Police are trying to find the killer. They say fatally stabbed a woman in Roland Park. WJZ is live at the scene. George Soul is with the latest on the search for the murder suspect and what we're learning about the unsuspecting victim from family and friends. George. Good evening, Marcus. The murder of 59 year old Molly McCulley has stunned the neighborhood and those that knew her best. The question on everyone's mind why? A Saturday morning wake-up call many in the Roland Park neighborhood never expected to get. This freaks me out. Police telling WJZ 59-year-old Molly McCauley was walking her dogs late Friday evening when someone fatally stabbed her and left her for dead in the 600 block of University Parkway. She was transported to an area hospital where unfortunately she died from her injuries. Police have not named a suspect or motive. Residents in this otherwise quiet neighborhood say they are at a loss for words over this violent murder. Within our neighborhood, no, I've never felt unsafe. WJZ is learning Macaulay worked for Resources for the Future in Washington, an organization that produces research on the environment and natural resources. Pete Nelson worked and was friends with Macaulay for the last that's, 20 that's years. What, when I think of what we lost, we just lost an extraordinarily kind person. Nelson says Molly had a quirky sense of humor and loved all things Baltimore. We would say, uh, you know, come on, Molly, like it's such a long commute, why don't you move down here? And she, she wouldn't have it. Her fellow coworker and friend, Margaret Wallace, tells WJZ she was also an animal lover having adopted the two that were with her when she was killed. She was really a dog person and uh, she worked with rescue organizations. Police tell WJZ they will have an increased presence in the community. Now tonight police are asking anyone in the neighborhood with security cameras to review them to see if they noticed anything suspicious before the attack. Reporting live in Roland Park tonight, George Solis, WJZ Eyewitness News. All right, George, thank you. And anyone with information on this brutal murder is urged to call Metro Crime Stoppers.